English for teachers. Number eighteen. Conversations between a teacher and a student about school rules for parents. How can I support my child's learning? Encourage reading and provide guidance. Is my child participating in class? Yes, actively engaging and contributing. What are my child's strengths? Excellent problem solving and creativity. Does my child need extra help? Additional practice would be beneficial. How can we improve communication? Regularly check the school portal. Are there any behavior concerns? Polite and respectful towards peers. Can you suggest educational resources? Online platforms for interactive learning. Is my child completing assignments? Generally, submits work on time. Does my child participate in discussions? Active and contributes valuable insights. How can I help with homework? Provide a quiet study environment. Is my child confident in class? Developing self-assurance and participation. Are there any areas of improvement? Focus on improving organization skills. What can I do to motivate my child? Recognize and praise achievements consistently. Does my child ask for help? Shows initiative in seeking assistance. How can we address absenteeism? Regular school attendance is crucial. Are there opportunities for parental involvement? Parent-teacher conferences and volunteering. What is my child's attitude towards learning? Enthusiastic and open to challenges. How can I support classroom discipline? Reinforce classroom rules at home. Is my child making progress? Making steady progress academically. Can you recommend study techniques? Encourage effective time management skills. How can we foster a love for reading? Provide a variety of interesting books. Does my child complete homework independently? Developing independence, but occasionally needs guidance. Is my child respectful to teachers? Shows respect and follows instructions. How can we manage test anxiety? Teach relaxation techniques and practice. Does my child actively participate in group activities? Collaborate well and contribute ideas. What are the class expectations? Respect, responsibility, and active participation. Can you provide feedback on my child's progress? Regular progress reports are sent home. How can I encourage good study habits? Establish a consistent study routine. Does my child complete assignments with accuracy? Generally demonstrates good attention to detail. How can we reinforce classroom learning at home? Engage in discussions and review concepts. Are there opportunities for extracurricular activities? Explore clubs and sports within school. What can we do to improve time management? Set realistic goals and prioritize tasks. How can I help my child prepare for tests? Review key concepts and practice regularly. Does my child participate in class presentations? Developing confidence in public speaking. What can we do to develop critical thinking skills? Encourage problem-solving activities and discussions. 19. Conversations between the head of school and the teacher about school rules for teachers. Punctuality is crucial. Always be on time. I'll ensure prompt attendance. Thanks. Dress professionally. Set a good example. I'll dress appropriately. No worries. Avoid using cell phones during class. 
I'll keep my phone away. Maintain a respectful tone with students. I'll communicate with respect. Prepare lesson plans in advance. I'll plan lessons ahead. Submit attendance reports. Provide constructive feedback to students. I'll give helpful feedback. Avoid using offensive language in class. I'll use appropriate language. Keep parents informed about student progress. I'll update parents regularly. Attend staff meetings and training sessions. I'll be present at meetings. Use positive reinforcement to motivate students. I'll motivate students positively. Adhere to the school's grading policy. I'll follow the grading policy. Respect student confidentiality and privacy. I'll maintain student confidentiality. Implement effective classroom management strategies. I'll manage the class well. Encourage a safe and inclusive learning environment. I'll promote a welcoming atmosphere. Seek permission for leave or absences in advance. I'll request leave beforehand. Monitor student behavior and address issues promptly. I'll handle behavior concerns promptly. Use teaching resources effectively. I'll utilize resources efficiently. Encourage independent thinking and problem solving. I'll foster critical thinking skills. Engage students through interactive teaching methods. I'll use interactive teaching techniques. Collaborate with colleagues and share best practices. I'll cooperate with fellow teachers. Promote a culture of respect and diversity. I'll embrace diversity in class. Monitor and record student attendance daily. I'll track attendance regularly. Keep up with professional development opportunities. I'll pursue professional growth. Ensure the safety of students at all times. I'll prioritize student safety. Maintain confidentiality regarding school matters. I'll keep information confidential. Address individual learning needs of students. I'll cater to different learners. Conversations between a teacher and a student about attending classes. Good morning, Joey. Did you attend all your <laughs> classes, Joey? Student in every class and actively participated too. Joey, I noticed you were absent yesterday. Is everything all right? I apologize, Yasser. I had a family emergency, but I'll make sure to catch up on what I missed. Joey, why were you late for class this morning? I'm sorry, Yasser. I had trouble with public transportation, but I managed to arrive as soon as I could. Joey, I've noticed you seem disengaged during our sessions. Is there something bothering you? I apologize, Yasir. I've been dealing with some personal issues lately, but I'll make an effort to stay focused. Joey, it's important to come prepared for class. Did you complete the assigned homework? Yes, Yasir. I finished the homework and even did some extra practice exercises. Joey, I've observed that you are frequently absent. Is there a specific reason for that? I'm sorry, Yasir. I've been feeling unwell lately, but I'll try my best to attend regularly. Joey, your class participation has been exceptional lately. Keep up the good work. Thank you, Yasir. I'm trying my best to actively engage and contribute to the discussions. Joey, I appreciate your enthusiasm in class. Your energy is infectious. Thank you, Yasir. I really enjoy the subject and it motivates me to actively participate. Joey, I've noticed you often arrive late for class. Is there a specific reason for this? I apologize, Yasir. I have another class right before this one. And sometimes, the transition takes longer than expected. Joey, you have been consistently attending class and showing great dedication. Well done! 
Thank you, Yasir. I believe regular attendance is crucial for my progress, and I'm committed to it. Joey, it seems you're struggling to keep up with the class material. Is there anything I can do to help? Thank you for your concern, Yasir. I'll make sure to reach out if I need any extra assistance. Joey, your class participation has been lacking recently. Is there something you'd like to share? I'm sorry, Yasir. I've been feeling a bit shy lately, but I'll work on overcoming it and contribute more actively. Joey, you were absent for the past few classes. Is everything okay? I apologize, Yasir. I was unwell, but now I'm feeling better and ready to catch up on the missed lessons. Joey, I appreciate your effort to attend all the classes. Your dedication is commendable. Thank you, Yasir. I believe attending classes regularly is essential for my learning journey. And with that, we are done with this page. So there is a very nice quote: Teachers don't just teach subjects. They illuminate possibilities. They are the architects of dreams, constructing bridges to a brighter future for every student. And it is indeed very true.